then my colleague had to say no, because Charles the Twelfth is almost unmentionable in Sweden today. Because, oh. and then some in Sweden wanted Sweden that was neutral both during the first and the second world war. They wanted Sweden to take part on the German and Austrian side. And they said that we are obliged to fulfill what Charles XII started, namely fighting the Russians. And then the same demand came during the Second World War. And also by then, Joachim von Riventrop, that was the Nazi German foreign minister, he meets the Swedish ambassador in Berlin saying that, you know what? The German army is now so successful and we did something that you didn't do. We have conquered Poltava. Uh, 